Regional bank stocks surging on upbeat deposit news from Western Alliance. Yahoo Finance contributor Rem Remy Blair is on the floor of the New York Stock Exchange with the details. Hey, Remy. Hi there. Well, heading into the closing bell here at the New York Stock Exchange, the major U.S. stock averages are seeing a strong advance, with the averages up by nearly 1% on the session. And speaking of a strong advance, regional bank stocks saw a strong surge today, and this did come on the heels of some good news regarding deposit growth. We saw Western Alliance pop by over 10% on the session, and this came on signs of some bank deposit stability. According to a regulatory filing for that regional bank, uh, we did see that deposit growth um, ballooned by $2 billion since the beginning of the second quarter of this year. And that would bring total deposits to approximately $50 billion as of May 12th. And that is also an increase compared to the end of last quarter of this year. Not surprisingly, when you look at the year-to-date chart for this uh, bank, we see plenty of volatility. And we all have to consider that uh, we did see the failure of Silicon Valley Bank as well as Signature Bank at the end of March. Now, following the positive deposit growth news out from Western mm -hmm. Alliance, we also saw a boost in shares for PacWest Bancor. It was up by over 17% today, and it has recovered the $5 level. Keep in mind that earlier this month, uh, we did see shares of PacWest Bancord uh, fall, and this did come on news that it was exploring a possible sale in early May. On the heels of today's pop for both of those regional banks, we saw other New York Stock Exchange listed regional names, such as New York Community Bancor, as well as Keycor, Comerica, and Trust Financial gain on the session. Back to you. All right, Remy Blair, Yahoo Finance contributor there with a check on the markets for the day.